gosh, I keep going back to the Ed Reed. Guy wrote a story. It's so funny. He said, uh, he, he, he got fit. first of all, I want to know, $50,000 in cash? What, what, was it in 10s and 20s? The guy said, was it, a, was, was it a bag on the front seat that had a big dollar sign on it, like from a Bugs Bunny cartoon? Or was it, what, a, 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 a um, was it $50,000 bills? I mean, you're not supposed to like put that in a bag and, and have, a, have it chained to your wrist. Oh, I'll just leave the money right here in the front seat. Nobody's going to bother it. Oh, 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 I'll go to the next bank. <laughs> what the? <laughs> I just, I can't get over it. Some guys make it rain. Some guys invest in bad restaurant ideas and... and this guy just leaves 50 grand. And a guy wrote, hopefully he has insurance for the money. <laughs> yeah, right. $50,000. Could you imagine the guy that breaks the window and snatches the bag and runs home and like, oh my God, <laughs> crime does pay. I want, I'm gonna follow this forever. I'm all, every day I'm gonna Google Ed Reed and see what's the latest. How can you do that? I get carried away watching people in 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 Jersey who park in a mall, you know, a little little strip mall to get a cup of coffee, and they leave the car running with the keys in it. And I walk by, and I'm like, yeah, my first reaction is, oh God, there's a kid in the car. I'm looking, and I'm like, oh, it's just the car's running with the keys in it, and the door's unlocked. Okay, I grew up in the South Bronx, like that ain't happening. Hey, where's my car? I just ran in to get a cup of coffee. You know, and he wanted just like some, like a, it seemed like a Mel Brooks movie. Oh my God, my $50,000 is gone, you know. Now, I was going to say, how do we know it's $50,000? Well, he took $50,000 out of the bank, so I guess that, that kind of covers that. But, he, I mean, was it a, I guess, a, a brown paper bag that you put your sandwich in? One of those? All crumpled up? It wasn't a Gucci bag. It wasn't, you know, the Prada make bags. I don't know. Is it, you, you know, you read Reed. You're going to the Hall of Fame. You've been playing forever. I'd like $50,000 in cash, please, out of my account. Um, and just put it in this bag. Well, let me take my sandwich out first. <laughs> And when, you know, they always tell you, when you get your change, you count your change. 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 5,000, 6,000, 7,000. And they follow them from the bank. Man, I got $100 in my pocket. I'm looking over my shoulder. <laughs> this guy's got 50000 I didn't leave it on the front seat. I'm sorry I keep talking about this story, but it's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. The athletes have done some dumb things. He should have just went to New Orleans and just thrown the 50000 into strippers and gone home. I mean, what, what was the point? If he was giving $1,000 bills to homeless people, I'd be, all right, Ed. No. Let's go to Nick in uh, Riverdale. Nick, you're on the fan. Hey, Ed, how you doing? 